Yeah, I never thought I'd be directing the king of pop in a bush. That was a first for me, definitely. What's going on people, I'm Adam Deacon and we're here with Capital Extra and I'm here to talk about Some Otherhood and Some Otherhoods. How did you approach certain celebs to make cameos in Some Otherhood? A lot of it was me and Jazzy, my co-producer. We were just on our phones trying to ring everyone we know, kind of ask them would they be up for it. And we had a great casting director that helped us out a lot as well. So we were really blessed with cast. What was the funniest thing that happened on set with Jeremy Corbyn? The funniest thing with Jeremy Corbyn was probably the fact he couldn't quite remember the lines how we wrote them. So we just kind of improvised and we got it out of him in the end and he smashed it. Were there any moments while filming Some Otherhood that was a first for you? Yeah, I never thought I'd be directing the king of pop in a bush. That was a first for me, definitely. How did casting Ed Sheeran's role come about? I always knew we wanted Ed in the film. I didn't know how we were gonna quite make it happen, but then I managed to get a FaceTime with him. He was just down for it. He said he was a massive fan. He was a big supporter of my early work. And we just went from there and I wanted to kind of push Ed to a place where we haven't seen him like this before. So he just saw the vision. He smashed it, yeah. Who has the most unexpected party trick from the Some Otherhood cast? Jazzy was probably partying the most on set in between takes, but I've probably got the best party trick. Not a lot of people know this, but I can twist my whole tongue around. So bear with me one sec, yeah? I don't know if you saw that. I don't know if you quite caught that on camera, but yeah. Which non-actor surprised you with their acting skills the most? I thought Mega Man done really well. I was really surprised. I think that was his first time acting and I was really taken back by it. And Yomi Anderson too. That was her first time in a film and she smashed it. Can you recall the most unexpected moment between your co-stars? I think when we were filming with Ed Sheeran and he just started improvising for a moment and it was just really funny and I ended up using it in the film, but that was unexpected. Would you rather go on a night out with Stormzy in Croydon or RD in Brighton? Maybe RD in Brighton, just because I think Brighton is sick. I've been there a few times and I love the vibe there, but a night out with Stormzy would be sick as well, but yeah, maybe both in Brighton would be the one. Would you rather live with Idris Elba in Hackney or Dampson Idris in Peckham? Probably Idris Elba in Hackney, yeah. I'm a hackney boy. Would you rather go for your morning run with Ray and Tootin or Lethal Bizzle in Walthamstow? Probably Lethal Bizzle in Walthamstow. It's a bit closer to where I live, so yeah, I'll go Walthamstow. Would you rather shoot your next film with Ashley Waters in Peckham or Daniel Kaluuya in Camden? To be honest, this is really hard because I rate both of them as actors, so I would have to go to both. I would have to go to Peckham and I'd have to go to Camden to work with both of them. Would you rather have a staycation with Mo Gilligan in Lambeth or Maya Jammer in Bristol? I will pick Maya Jammer in Bristol, yeah. Would you rather play hide and seek with Ed Sheeran in Suffolk or Jeremy Corbyn in Wiltshire? Probably Ed Sheeran in Suffolk. I've been to his house and it is amazing. Like, it is so sick. So playing hide and seek there would be, would be mad. I'm Adam Deacon with Capital Extra and make sure you check out Some Otherhood October 13th.